Ladies and gents, boys and girls, check it out from the nice folks at J Rocket Audio Designs. It is the Clockwork Echo, designed, as I'm told, by the original designer of the Deluxe Memory Man pedal. So this is kind of their take on that style circuit, uh, and it, it really has that sonic character, but it's got some really, really cool modern features as well that kind of set it apart. The traditional stuff, first of all, you got a mix control there, you got a volume control to kind of bump up the level. When you bring up the mix, you'll notice the dry signal goes down a bit, so you, then you can compensate by turning up that gain control there. You've got a speed and a depth control, both actually for the modulation, and then you've got a delay time control here and a delay regeneration or feedback. Turn that regen control all the way up or that feedback control, and it's actually quite a controlled oscillation. It doesn't get like out of control and like distort on itself or anything like that, but it just tails out really, really, really long, and you can get everything from, you know, quick slapback echoes with one repeat all the way out to kind of continuous long uh, sustained controlled echoes. Now one really nice thing, there's a couple expression pedal inputs and one of the things you can control via expression is the repeats. So if you want to like ramp up just like the last note of a solo or something and make it tail out really long, you can do that and then back it down and get just a couple repeats. So this pedal's got stereo, left and right outs. You can use it like a traditional Deluxe Memory Man where you know you just, just use it in mono. But if you want to get a cool stereo spread going, you heard that on the first guitar part on the song at the beginning of the video. It's got one side out of phase with the other and you get this beautiful, lush, kind of very, I don't know how to describe it. It's just a really organic kind of stereo spread. And I'll solo that part outside of the mix in just a minute here so you can really hear uh, how lush it is and how cool it is to use this pedal in stereo. The mod will take you anywhere from really subtle chorusing to like on up to, you know, full on seasick, you know, fast rate vibrato basically. And there's a switch right here that allows you to turn the mod on and off via foot switch. If you want to get more like DM2 style, like no modulation, straight up analog delay, you can do that. And I used that for a few parts on the track at the beginning of the video. Or you can just foot switch on that mod and get some really, really cool chorusing or vibrato type effects. Now this is the tempo control here, so you can select the delay tempo via that rotary control, or you've got tap tempo. It's just a straight up quarter note tap. Or of course you could tap in eighths or tap in dotted eighths, whatever you want to do. I find the pedal works mainly just like an original Deluxe Memory Man does best in front of an amplifier. You could use it in a loop as long as it's a pedal style loop. The pedal really sort of works best in front of an amp and that's the way I used it for all the tracks on the song at the beginning of the video. Even into dirt, I mean the mix control is fairly you know forgiving as far as being able to turn it up in front of like a dirty solo sound and that's how I played that solo on the Les Paul in the song at the beginning of the video. I had quite a bit of gain happening, was using the wah and I was still able to use the pedal in front of the amp and get a really cool, albeit dirt dirty but really cool vibey delay in front of a dirty amplifier. That's the way you did Echo after all in the 70s. Paige, Eddie Van Halen, Joe Walsh, you ran it in front. So let's solo some of those parts now from the track at the beginning of the video outside of the mix. I did everything from slap delay to you know longer delays, dotted eighths with just like a single repeat so that I could play like melodic lines up and down the neck with the delay bouncing back. I manipulated the time control as well so I could do like crazy ramp up and ramp down pitch variation kind of delay sounds. So after watching these parts soloed outside of the mix, you, sh you should get a good idea of what this pedal's capable of and of the sonic character. All right, here we go.
Delay aficionados, echo freaks, it's the clockwork from the folks at J-Rocket Audio Designs. Their take on the classic deluxe Memory Man style pedal with a few cool modern twists, tap tempo, ability to foot switch the mod on and off, as well as expression pedal inputs, as well as stereo. You can check it out further at the link down there in the video description below. Click there and it'll take you to all the info that you need to know and that you want to know and that you could ever hope to know about the Clockwork Echo from the nice folks at J-Rocket Audio Design. Please hit subscribe and hit the little bell beside the subscribe button. You'll get an alert every time I put out a new video. I am Pete Thorne. Take care, you guys. Over and out.